Hey what's up guys Shazad here so lots of phones coming out in 2015 have a raw photo capability raw photo is basically an uncompressed format for pictures that stores a lot more detail and information compared to JPEG which is compressed because raw is uncompressed you can tweak the image a lot in post and when I say a lot I really mean a lot so to get the full advantage of that raw data you must have a good application and now there are a couple of options for Android. Starting with my favorite photo editing app of all time, Snapseed. With the latest update, now users can develop raw photo in Snapseed. But it's not very stable and as of now, it doesn't allow you to edit raw photos taken from DSLR. But the smartphone's raw photos would be fine. Next app is called Photomate R2 and this app is amazing. It has all of the features and tools that we usually get on PC version of Lightroom. Plus you can edit raw photos taken from your DSLR as well. Let's take a look at some of its tools. First of all you can see the metadata of the image. Then there is white balance and tint correction tool. Then you can change the exposure, contrast, highlight, shadows and all of that stuff. You can also add clarity, vibrance, saturation, do noise removal and also add sharpness to the image. These are some interesting tools. With the lens adjustment tool, you can correct the distortion of your image and there are also different lens profile which is great. Then there is color adjustment, gradient filter and the most important color curves are available here as well. And finally, when you are ready to export, you can choose the directory where you want to save the final image. You can change output formats like JPEG, PNG and TIFF. And if you want, there is also a watermark option here. So as I said, this app is amazing. The reason why I chose this over the Adobe Lightroom for Android because Photomate has more features and if you want to use Adobe Lightroom for Android, you gotta have the Creative Cloud license. Now let me quickly edit one picture and I will show you the before and after. So guys that's pretty much it for this video, thanks a lot for watching and I will see you all in the next one.